There's some pulsing reaction inside my gem. I didn't notice it at first, but now it's stronger. Rallis, destroy them! Oh, orbs? There's no power here, but I can see the orbs appear. Some link between her and the phoenix is recharging our gems! Wait, hear us out. I must kill the intruders. Please don't kill us! I don't want to be doomed! Snap out of it. What is the true nature of your relationship with this star being? Ah, he's going to kill us unless I bring him back. But the Princess of Ruins, the one who's in control of him, what should I do? Snap Rallis out of it, fight Rallis, go after the Princess of Ruin. Well, you know what they say. Save scum and then be a brave man. That is a saying I just made up. Bam! I must go after the source. She's the cause of all his pain. Just go for the source. This is going to end badly. Stop forcing your control over Rallis. Wait, Okay, Piggy. <clears throat> I'll force everything against her. Oh. Is it working? You dare attack me? I will show you no mercy. No, wait. Okay, Piggy. What was that? It was so swift. The pain lasted for only a second. What did I do? There was a reason that the others didn't fight against her. I messed up. I'm sorry if I caused anyone else to die. I'm sorry. Bad ending. Fuck. Yeah, I thought that would happen. Alright, hang on. Let's go back, lads. I'm not sure this game whether we've put anyone on the smiting list. It seems to be something I've um, neglected. But uh, the Princess of Ruin is firmly on the smiting list. People we will have to smite at some point. Uh, snap Rallis out of it. <clears throat> Rallis, snap out of it, please. Must destroy. I'm sorry I couldn't help you before. We were almost out, but I was too slow. I don't want to fight you. I can't fight the one I love. So don't make me. <clears throat> love. Oh, God, love conquers all again. Rolls eyes. Is it working? Who reacted when I said that word? I love you. The other guys are ready to attack, but now they are just looking at each other in the confusion. <laughs> okay, Piggy, don't embarrass me. <laughs> Rallis, please come back to our side. Is that what you've been doing to sway my ruined knight all this time? Wait, please wait. Stop, stop. Don't hurt, Okay, Piggy. Why must you defy me? You are my servant. Destroy all who are against my will. I don't want to fall back under your spell. Why must you kill them all? They did nothing wrong. Why did you curse, Gordsis? Please remove the curse. And why did you dominate me? Please let me go. <laughs> that is like the most English way of trying to get shit done. Uh, uh, and oh, oh, wh why did you dominate me? Oh, please let me go. Like saying please and everything, Christ. And what's the link with you and the Phoenix? All those questions from my own servant. It's very odd how her as a star being takes a human form. I didn't think that would be her form. What is the link between you and the Ruined Knight? What is this link I feel to you? Please answer me. My gem pulses more. It's as though it's beating like a heart. Why must I answer those lower than me? I am a princess. Almost bend to my will. <clears throat> oh, my head. At least leave my friends alone and explain why we are linked. Do not continue to defy me. I created you to obey. We all manage to dodge with the distance we keep from them, and I almost find myself running into the black crystals. <sighs> what does she mean when she said created? Yes, what does this mean? I feel people shift behind me. Someone's doing something, but if I but if I turn my head, the enemy will notice. I created my ruin nice to serve and obey, to replace the untrustworthy humans who are not strong enough to carry out my order. Are you from our world? You're someone who was lost to the stars. What is your name? Well, that would be why she's in a human form. <laughs> Answered my question from like two minutes ago. Whatever happened before caused this person to lose herself. <laughs> How dare you question me? I'm the princess of ruin. That is who I am. I cast away everything unnecessary to become ruler of this domain. I'm sorry. I apologize just in case it'll appease her anger, but she continues to glare at us. Kion and I look at each other. He seems to understand what I'm thinking. The Phoenix said that if one forgets their identity, they are lost forever. It's why retaining your name is important. She adopted the personality where she believes she is above others and always right according to her logic. Whatever happened caused her to be hateful. Yeah, funny that. 
Reason will sway her, but will not bring her back to her original self. <sighs> the longer we stay in her presence, the more the gem pulses. I couldn't have been created, I was born in Godsitz. I recognise that I... all that I created. You are my knight. I sent you to destroy evil long ago. Long ago, negative energy appeared and started to spread in this world. I sent you to find and destroy the one responsible for creating such negative energy. After I sent you, the energy stopped spreading and you never returned. How long ago did this happen? Long ago. I even created and gave one order to my phoenix. I rested in peace, knowing she'd carry out my order, but here appears a woman with my phoenix's power. <clears throat> the phoenix is an eternal being from long ago? This princess has existed for that long. So you created the phoenix that had protected us. How a human must lose themselves to gain such power scares me. I said many ruined knights to get rid of evil, even some, some into the filthy human world, wherever there was a disturbance. Whenever negative energy appears, I send them, but none of them ever return. The knights you sent into the human world, they must have adapted to the humans. <laughs> and the phoenix learned speech and interacted with the humans. Everyone you sent adapted to their new environment. So these ruined knights never came back because... I was born in the human world, but my family history originated from the stars? It explains your power! Like... <laughs> Given that much, even I am trying to absorb that as fact. What other things has the Princess of Ruin made that influenced our world? Human power is never equal to those of my servants, they will never be! Then that is why I was born with such power. My ruined knight, you've returned to me, except that you are tainted by the filth of that corrupt world. Ugh, she's doing something to Rallis. You can continue to go against my will, so I will erase that filth in you. And you'll change back to what you're supposed to be. Stop! No! Keone's forcing the orbs at her. What are you doing? Okupigu, she was calmer before she came in contact with our gems. She became more and more emotional the more she visited me, and my gem gained power the more she visited. And with your gem here, she has changed much more. This has to be a weakness, please help. At least she's giving us answers. How dare you, forcing my creation against me? Remember, the wizards transform this power to go against the phoenix. This is also the Princess of Ruin's creation, so whatever the wizards did transform this power to go against the Princess of Ruin too. I must help. I force whatever's in here against her. You fools, what are you doing? <laughs> ah! Ah! The power forces Kiona me backwards. We hit the black crystals again and their rattling effect hits me again. This has to be the right option we chose originally. It's gone on for long enough. <sighs> must I end your lives with my own hands? Ah! We managed to stop her from attacking Alexander. We must continue to do this. Stop using that power against me. It's painful. Ah, ah. You insects think you can defy me and live. My servant, go get them. Yeah, yes. Uh. Zell, take care of Rallis. We can't give her any chance to recover or we're finished. But me against Rallis? Yeah, I thought it was as weird as you did. If I'm, I'm not standing your, I'm not rating your chances at all. Uh, I, I, he's struggling to contain that power inside him. Please don't make me fight you. I must fight it. Ah! Stop controlling me. The power knocks Keon and me back again and again. We continuously get our minds rattled by the crystals. Please help me. Ah. Uh. What was that? It came from the cracked crystal. I've been knocked back so much that the pain numbs and the crystals messed up my thoughts so I can't even think about pain. Huh? The, the voice from the crystal sounds like the Princess of Ruin? This is... this is... <laughs> Aim for the cracked crystals. <laughs> but they didn't break the other times you tried. Aim for the one with the Princess of Ruin cracked herself. All I wanted was dedicated knights who could help me, who would listen to my every word and dedicate their lives for me. 
and to all my enemies, they would suffer the consequences. Their children would also suffer, and even their children's children to live a life of ruin. Huh. She sounds pleasant. Ah, what are you doing? <clears throat> what is that? It's the same messages from the dreams. Huh? I sit by the crystals, unable to think, and all I can do is watch. <clears throat> all I wanted was a hero to save the day and make everything better. But he doesn't exist. No. How dare you! I threw all away all that is unnecessary. All that you threw away is crystallised here? That's why there's so much pain when we get near. How dare you all release them! My ruined knight! I took you back, but if you keep aiding the enemy like this, I will not tolerate you anymore. No, don't! I will not tolerate any more of this! Stop! Stop! Is Rallis going to take one for the team? Uh, stop! Your power's blowing me back! What is this power? Please stop, princess. The pain you threw away has echoed through all of Godsits, all the way into the people's dreams. Don't cast them away. Accept all of the pain you threw away. You were waiting for a hero all this time, but no one from your time had the ability to save you. Please remember all you wanted. I've come to save you. I want no such pain. I gave it all up so I can rest in peace. Everything you gave up took the form of another power. Please break these crystals. You want me to feel pain again. You are a terrible servant. But you do feel pain now, right? Whatever you gave up took the form of these crystals, and you gave up something else to take the form of the phoenix. <laughs> I know that because the phoenix's power exists in the form of these gems. And I can feel its link to you. And the return of that power is slowly giving you pain again. You can't handle it, but a hero has arrived. I will protect and save you. I do not need to be saved. But you were always calling for someone to help. I, I've cast away all the weaknesses away to become the Princess of Ruin. But the Phoenix's power is a form of one of your weaknesses. I'll destroy it all. Don't aim for Ogu Pegu. Princess, does it have to come to this? If I can't save everyone, I must choose. It's not what I wanted to do as a hero. But if I must, I must wield my power and do what's most important. I was afraid of my power. Afraid that it'd consume me. But my power is a gift, not a curse. I'll use it to save everyone. That is one hell of a light bulb. I'll give him that much. My servant, how... How dare you? We're still in the prison. What? What happened? Is she? <clears throat> it's okay. Everything's over. But you and Kyoma were on top of those crystals, and you had your brains rattled. Just recover. It's all better now. Uh, I have a headache. Me too. I shake my head a few times. Is everything over? It can't be. Zell, Alexander, and Rallis are all talking, but the words just go through my head. How do we get out? We're trapped in the Crystal Falls field. You can't feel it? This place was connected to that scary star being, but since she's gone, the power here is disappearing. Whoa! You're right! Let's leave. Rallis, save your strength. You and Kiyon were both smashed continuously against the crystals. It's so numb. And it's hard to remember that, or think. Rest, because we need both of you to open the gate. Uh, okay. This? Oh, right. <laughs> I was going to say, this does not look very nice. <clears throat> Is this drawn? Yes. It looked like a picture, because of like the wall, but then there are like two wooden bits here, which kind of disproved it, because this is sort of like awkwardly put on here, and this is too blurry. It's been a week and we're all recovering. That cave led straight to Gautzitz when we were at Rallis's place. Kion and I are still lying down since our minds were mostly scrambled during the fight. I was so dizzy I wasn't able to think properly until now. Are you sure we won't get robbed? They won't rob my friends. Besides, I'm a hero and this is my home. They'll listen to me. Famous last words. Just go home with Alexander. That's great to hear. I knew I can count on my hero. Oh, God, 49 episodes in and Zell is still a bit of a twat. Will you come to Azurea again? 
Eh, in the future. Thanks for everything, see you. <clears throat> so, Alexander and Zell are gone. I guess I should go back soon too. The cursed dreams of Gautzitz are gone. The people are all wondering what's up. Are you going to tell them you saved them? Yeah, they'll be happy to hear it, especially since I'm their hero and their hope. Maybe our town will finally change for the better from now on. They all listen to you. You're pretty amazing to achieve so much from this town. You even inspire me not to feel so hopeless. You have nothing to feel hopeless about? Well, it's just... Is it because you wonder where your power came from? You are, well, we are. Family? Oh god. Uh, what? Are you saying that my ancestors are actual ruined knights who adapted to this world? <laughs> ah! 49 episodes and still looks dumb. <laughs> Something's been explained to him and he just doesn't get it. <clears throat> yeah. So my ancestors were star beings? And they mingled with humans and like, that is why we have this immense power. That's the one. Yep. Uh, so we were really chosen as Ruin Knights for a reason? Yeah, we're special. Does that make us distant relatives? Yeah. Unfortunately. He is family. Oh god. That's scary. Alright, well at least he didn't turn out to be like my family. He'd just been hitting on me this whole time like Luke Skywalker. Ugh. Are you just messing with me? No. Are you alright, Ogipigu? I'm doing better. This is an interesting turn of events, so this Princess of Ruin caused such a mess, but this makes me curious about the star plane even more. Humans can gain the power of creation if they give up their humanity. I wonder what else may have happened to this world because of her. It seems you have some idea. In history, there were some catastrophic events caused by a small group of people. A group of people who could wipe out armies. So you're saying these ruined knights the Princess of Ruin sent were them? Maybe, but now she's gone, we won't have that problem anymore. To think that such an eternity has so much power to destroy, but the stars rob one of humanity so she would in fact it, unless something big happened to her. <clears throat> this makes me curious. I'd like to link these two to the family tree to see who else may have been linked to the stars. Okay, Piggy, I'd like to leave now if you don't mind. I know you'll want to stay, so we'll see each other again in the future. Will we? Will, do we have to see you again in the future? That... I'm slightly sad. Slightly. Not overly. Hey, you're leaving already? Did I hear you right? You want me to... You want to link me to my family tree? May I? <laughs> uh, no? Why not? You're related to Rallis, so aren't you curious to know about this? Well, I have my reasons. I'll cooperate. I've always been alone, so... Here, so I'd like to know who I'm linked to. And being linked to the tournament champion is quite nice. Space keeps not working, I don't get it. I've... Always admired you from afar, at least by your name. Uh, you my fan? Well... So we're like bros then. Oh my god. Ah, oh, Callum, just as I was about to say something nice about you as well. So, will you let me link you to brothers together, Callum? D I don't trust you researching me. <laughs> Twat. Okay, Piggy. Oh, hey, uh, what are you doing? Rallis ruffles my hair while the others argue in the background. I did this while you were recovering. You didn't object, so you can finally think properly now. <laughs> I did notice him doing it before, but... I wasn't really in the right mindset to appreciate it, and now I just cover my face as he keeps doing it. I'm glad you can think again. I wanted to talk to you, but you always responded with a strange rhetoric. That's not my fault, I'm sorry. It is your fault, you were the one who said it. I thought you were cute. I'm just glad you're okay. I'm sorry the accommodations aren't to your liking. Hey, who said they aren't? I might like grubby, charcoal smeared rooms. You never know. I don't, but you never know, I might. It's fine, I can't expect your place to be luxurious. Because of your belief in me, it gave me strength. I was troubled by how I got my hero title before, and that thought consumed me in the star plane, but you gave me the confidence to accept it all. 
I was juggling with the title of hero and struggling to be the perfect hero. But seeing how things didn't turn out the way I wanted them to, and having you give me strength, I felt like I was reborn. I feel like I can really be a proper hero, even with all my flaws. I've hidden the fact that I was from Gautzis, but now I'll tell the entire world and show them that my people aren't scums. Will you be fine if I stray from you a little longer? I fear you may leave, knowing I don't have enough attention to give you. I just want to fulfil my role before I move on. I'm fine with that, I can wait. You are. I don't deserve you. Oh my god. Oh, give me a bucket, I need to throw up into it. Are you going to say you're unworthy again? No, I'm I'm worthy of you. Whoa, arrogant. We support the underdog in our playthroughs. What's, what's this bullshit? After what I'll do next, perhaps I'll be more than worthy of you. Rallis announces birthplace to the world and tells of his heroic deed of removing the curse of Gautzitz. He requested A to rebuild Gautzitz and turn it into a hospitable place. Oh my gosh, that's really Rallis? Do you think it would be imposing if we talked to him? Yes, and he wouldn't like it either. Stay close to me, I need an excuse not to talk to them. Yep, see, thought as much. Rallis is too famous now, and he still can't talk to people properly. <laughs> what do you mean too famous now? How do you get more famous? The same people have heard of him, surely. <clears throat> but because people hold him in such high regard, they're also afraid to approach him. That's a good thing. <clears throat> Does... <laughs> Does he have a, a, a cloak around him? <laughs> oh dear. His hand is in an unnatural position, holy shit. His elbow and wrist must really hurt. I'm sorry that I have to use you as a shield. Uh, this is nothing. You've helped me th so many people, so I'll do my part and protect you from these civilians. After our ordeal in the Star Plane, most conflicts in this world are nothing to us. <clears throat> Rallis can use his hero title to get luxuries. Well, I start to feel guilty using it as an advantage, but he assures me that I deserve it, and I am the only one who deserves so much. Okay, Piggy, thank you for being in my life. Oh, God, that's the kind of thing which, like, 16-year-olds tell each other on Tumblr and Instagram. Ugh. Without you, I'd never have achieved my goals, but I would never be able to fully accept my hero status. If I could show you how much your existence means to me, you've already shown me enough. What I've given you isn't enough. Who uh, are? If you keep giving me things, I'm going to have to take advantage of your kindness again. You are the only one I'd let take advantage of me, so go ahead. Then what if I... What do you want? I can't do that to you. He trusts me so much that he'll fall victim to my wants. Don't tell me I must protect you from myself. Tell me what you want. Stop asking me that, otherwise I might just request it. <sighs> you know what's coming, don't you? It better not be cheesy on what I'm thinking. If it'll make you happy, I'll fulfil it. He keeps tempting me, and I've already given in so many times. I must protect him from himself. From myself. Having a hero's power in my fingertips might prove to be dangerous. I know I can trust you. If I ever put him in danger, will he realise it? The love of a hero's life should be the happiest one in the world. Okay, no, no cheesy lines used towards the end. Ending 17. Ending 17. That is a wrap, folks. I presume if we click, we just get to the main menu. So we'll just leave this up a little more. 49 parts. This game took. Longer series ever. I'm kind of glad it didn't get to 50. But, oh well. Thank you very much to Unbroken Hours, first of all, for making this game. I think we can all give a, a slight round of applause, can't we? Slight round of applause. I'm English, it has to be polite and quiet. But, slight round of applause. Well done for White Priestess for watching the whole of the series, despite knowing everything about the game. All you're watching is someone slowly rubbish it. I no idea how people do it. It's really impressive. But yeah, thanks to all, of course, all the other people who've watched this series until this far. It's, what, 49 parts of 15 minutes each. So... Assuming that's three, so yeah, I mean, it, it's about 15 hours I, I run over sometimes, so let's just add that, like 16 hours of me talking and playing a game. So, thank you for everyone who uh, watched, who liked, who commented, you're all lovely, so that's fine. Um, this game was good, 
it, 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 it's very good. If it doesn't end up on my top five list at the end of the year, I'll be shocked. This did come out late December, but it came out too late for anything, so I can't notice this year. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd say, you know, what happened before, like, the exposition, but... I mean, that's not really much of a big deal, if I'm perfectly honest, because they got rid of most of it, so it's fine. It could have been done slightly better in places, but overall it was done fine. The story was good. Um, I did get that feeling, like, several times where you're like, fuck, I'm in a new world, and, and I'm exploring this new world. Obviously, I mean, bar... The thing is, just like, when I say I don't like a character, it's not that I don't th I think that character is bad. I just don't necessarily like him. I like interesting characters. I'm the kind of person who likes Joffrey from Game of Thrones, right? Because I think he's an interesting character. I I did like Keown, despite me joking and calling him like a tosser several times throughout. But I did like Keown, because he was an interesting character. But that's why I didn't like Callum, because I thought he was sort of just like a walking stereotype kind of thing and then siren was just <laughs> we got to the game and he's at the end of the game the most important bit wasn't even there like <laughs> completely useless right not interesting in any way so um well i've got other than those like th there were very interesting characters you couldn't define them by one personality trait like, like Rallis, for example, you couldn't say noble because there are more things to him than that. And that's why I like, and there was a lot of that throughout this game. I would thoroughly recommend everyone plays this. A link to buy it is in the description below. There are six routes, 17 endings, right? And I only thought there was a good and bad ending for each one. So there are more endings. Also, obviously, I went for Rallis. You can go for Alexander, who I'm tro I'm probably going to do him off-screen now. Because he was probably the second most interesting character, and I want to see if the game uh, changes its storytelling. So you experience something completely different if you go down his path, not just exactly the same. Because that would be pretty cool. But yeah, I, I, I definitely think we need to conclude now. My name's been Tenarium. Thank you all so very much for watching. And until next time, we'll see you then.